So one last 10 a.m. wrap here from Friday game day. Back in the kitchen, Sacra Gray has got her breakfast sandwich. So here's the thing, is if you don't know how to cook, you just recruit somebody that knows how to cook, and then you cheer them on the whole way. I have learned the secret to life is just admit your failures and then find someone who can do it and then root for them. So this is Ryder's creation. Woo! She says that she almost spills it all over Ryder's her. creation. Ryder, <laughs> come smile with your creation. All right. Big smile. How, how's it feel? Uh, how's it looking? It looks pretty good. Plate still feels kind of warm underneath, yeah, so, so we should probably let this cool. Yeah. <laughs> but I was like, okay, it was time to flip it, and I was like, Ryder, how do we flip it? He goes, well, that's next week. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta just get it in the wrist, you know? You can, we can get a little, well, give us a little wrist flip. Just a little whoop. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> here, uh, you, want me, you want me to give it, do it for you? Yeah, you, you give it a shot. All right, here, you give it a shot. Oh, my bad, here. This is what you gotta do, Steven. Learn, learn to suffer a little something. Just give it the wrist. There, Bang! There we go. A little bit of money. Let's walk over to our next crew here because, guys, the uh, the art of the bacon, egg, and cheese is uh, a long, long lost art passed down from New Yorker to New Yorker. And do you feel that you've learned how to make the ideal bacon, egg, and cheese at this juncture? Oh, definitely, yeah. Yeah. What What is the key? What's the secret for you? Um, probably just making sure the biscuit tastes really good because that's the most important part of it to me. So mm, I like that. I like that. So guys, a couple couple more questions for you before we let you go here. Yeah. What what kind of techniques? I mean, is it knife techniques? Is it cook techniques? Like, what are some of the things that you've learned that have been surprising to you in here? Uh, surprising. Uh, some of the knife techniques are uh, a little uh, different from the ones that I I originally learned at home, but uh, they really help me from not cutting myself a lot. <laughs> um, Cooking techniques, uh, yeah, there's there's been a couple, yeah. and also how we, we set up our stations. Yeah, how do you, how do you like this group of kids, especially in this group, and uh, and and just the camaraderie that is had in this kitchen? It's good. We all work well together. We all do our jobs, and we get things done. Awesome, awesome guys. So one last time, Sacra's finally got the bacon on hers. I got the bacon. This is Chef, Chef Z. It's got to be beaming with pride, man. This is this is some real good stuff, Sacra. Oh, you're well. You know, first off, I have awesome students, and really, we, I work in a district that provides us everything. I mean, look at this beautiful kitchen we have. Um, I'm so lucky to be here. So lucky to be surrounded by great staff, great students. Uh, it's an awesome, awesome spot to be. So it makes the job pretty easy. Not gonna lie, Andrew. I would imagine, and I think that's all we got for the 10 a.m. hour of Friday game day, Sacra. Cheers, cheers to you. Cheers, cheers to you. Well, done. we'll see you guys back home, guys. Cheers to you as well. Mm-hmm.